Hey, this is Sonny James from Serato here in Los Angeles. We've been unpacking Serato DJ Pro, one awesome feature at a time. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to use cue points when you're mixing. A cue point is sort of a bookmark that saves to a track and allows you to quickly jump back to or trigger it again. I use cue points frequently to quickly jump ahead to a bridge or hook of a song that an audience may be anticipating. I'll also use them to creatively rearrange a composition of a song to surprise the listeners. You can easily set cue points by pressing the buttons or pads on your controller, like this. If you no longer want the cue points you've set, you can easily remove them by holding the shift button on your controller and tapping the pads with the corresponding cue points you want to go. You can also use your computer keyboard to set cue points. To use this method, press shift plus the number keys 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, which will set and trigger cues for the left deck, and shift plus 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0, which will set and trigger cue points for the right deck. Here, you can easily delete a cue by using your trackpad or mouse and clicking the small x on the cue point on screen. I find it best to place a cue point at the beginning of a track on the downbeat and also on other major parts of the song that you may want to jump to, like the chorus, outro, or breakdown. You can also name your cue points by double clicking on them like this. Many DJs like to use our color coding options to create a uniform system of knowing what each cue point represents at a glance. For instance, red could mean that the track starts here, while yellow could mean that there's an eight bar count in, and green means the verse starts now. Once you have created a cue point for your track, it will be saved and automatically shown the next time you play the track. If you share or move your music library, the cue point will still be there when you open it in Serato again, as the metadata is written to the MP3 file. This also applies to tracks included in the integrated streaming services. So that's cue points in Serato DJ Pro in a nutshell. Once you're in the habit of setting them on new tracks, you'll find it can really help speed up your workflow when mixing and be a useful tool for highlighting key moments of songs for your audience. Try it out for yourself, and we'll see you next time.